The type of flow is an important factor when considering energy loss within a hydraulic circuit. There are two different types of flow, laminar flow and turbulent flow. The type of flow may be determined using Reynolds number. Reynolds number is dependent on the velocity of flow, viscosity of a liquid and on the cross-sectional area through to which flow occurs. Liquid from the tank enters the transparent pipe. The flow rate is regulated by a valve. The ink enters the center of the pipe through a thin tube. up to a certain velocity. Liquids move along pipes in layers. The innermost liquid layer at the pipe surface does not move. This is the laminar flow. If the velocity of flow is increased, at the critical velocity the type of flow changes from laminar to turbulent. Open the valve more, the flow through the pipe will increase. The flow becomes whirling. The flow resistance increases and thus the hydraulic losses increase. This is the turbulent flow. Turbulent flow is not usually desirable because the flow resistance increases and the hydraulic losses increase.